safety training has become critical in the industries that we work for uh, and probably beyond the industries that we work for. Uh, there's a significant lack of skilled labor. Uh, there's a much younger workforce now that they're hiring. They're much more remote, which all those things make training that much more complicated, expensive, uh, difficult. Uh, most importantly, I think for the extended reality space is having a younger workforce, they just need to be trained differently. Uh, the way I was trained in my old age uh, was in person or grab a helmet and you know uh, follow that guy. Um, today, um, the younger workforce doesn't learn that way. So VR has uh, increased, been proven to increase uh, retention, reduce costs uh, to three or four times, uh, three or four times faster. The retention's higher, and um, we think it's because of there's you're training a younger workforce. So even why while, while they're they're still unskilled coming in, they're able to learn uh, at a different rate because of this new medium. This is a costly problem for one of our clients um, that is uh, in the insurance business, and they insure very large uh, construction companies, mostly. And their agents are taking out VR headsets to their customers. And they found that they have 100% higher engagement with the VR training and what they were training on before. Um, and they're starting to see a reduction uh, in accidents lowering premiums. So it's a, it's a win for everybody. The uh, insurance company um, is lowering their payouts because there's a reduction in uh, accidents and the company is finding higher retention leading to higher productivity.